Cheetah hugs and licks his human pal whenever they're reunited. An animal lover gets a huge hug during an emotional reunion with his old mate, a fully grown cheetah. Volunteer Dolph Volker, 50, had not seen Gabriel for a year. But the three-year-old big cat had not forgotten Dolph when he returned to the Cheetah Experience Breeding Center in Bloemfontein, South Africa. American Dolph said, It started when Gabriel was a cub. I remember what he used to like to do, putting his paws on my shoulder, laying on me, grooming me. Dolph Seewacher, 50, met Gabriel at the Cheetah Experience Breeding Center in Bloemfontein, South Africa where he's volunteered on and off for four years. They first met when Gabriel was just eight months old, and quickly formed a special bond. Dolph would hand-feed the cheetah cub and curl up next to him out in the open. It takes a long time to reach an imprinting and bonding relationship with a wild animal, says Dolph. A wild predator. It started when Gabriel was a cub and I got to know him at eight months old. It was an absolute joy. We became super friends. Gabriel is very special to me for a number of reasons. Probably the biggest one is that he fulfilled a lifelong dream. I always wanted to befriend some predator. Now, whenever Dolph returns to the center, Gabriel greets him with a hug around his shoulder and licks to the face. He remembers all the special things we used to do and I remember what he used to like to do, says Dolph. You know, getting up close putting his paws on my shoulder, laying on me and grooming me. Last year Dolph was thrilled to find out that he could officially buy Gabriel from Cheetah Experience and become his legal owner, which would allow him to enter Gabriel's enclosure whenever he visits and receive regular reports on the cheetah's well-being when Dolph is back in the U.S. where he lives. I'm still learning about him, says Dolph. After long stints of time away from them all, I do have certain apprehension and caution with some of the cheetahs. I'm not suddenly going to come up and grab a cheetah I haven't seen in a year. That's just crazy. People wonder if cheetahs are dangerous. Okay, they are a weapon from tongue to tail. I've never personally been attacked, but I have been injured by them, 